Hello, my name is Alex Murray and I'm the Solihull Police Commander. On this monthly message I wanted to highlight some of the great work that my staff have done but also that of the community. Firstly though I'd like to welcome David Jameson who knows Solihull really well, particularly Chelmsley. He's our new Police and Crime Commissioner. I also want to thank my police officers for working really hard to get crime down at the moment. Burglary's down 30% so far this year and robbery's down as well. But here's a couple of examples. Firstly, an officer just over in the town last week was helping a taxi driver who'd been assaulted and then was knocked unconscious himself and ended up in hospital. But only the day after, he was chasing a burglar down this street, managed to catch him and return the items to the old lady who'd been burgled. And those were items that belonged to her husband who had previously passed away. Another example then was an officer who was helping someone who'd been assaulted. She was looking after him in the town. Uh, another member of the public came along, uh, rugby tackled her and knocked her to the ground. But another group of people saw what took place, realised it wasn't acceptable, chased after the offender, caught him. He was arrested and brought to justice. And that's what's really good about Solihull, is that people really care around improving community safety. And it encouraged people to work with us on neighbourhood watch or street watch or speed watch to make Solihull safer. I've had the privilege of being with the family of Stephen Beckett who was killed on Bill's Lane only a couple of weeks ago. His grandson is still in critical care in hospital. And it just drives home the importance of road safety. And we will do what we can to tackle road safety issues. And it's great when the community comes on board and assists us doing that as well. And finally, while I'm on road safety issues, we're launching a campaign to take cars off the road from offenders who haven't been taking out their insurance. You'll see over the next couple of months, uh, the amount of cars we seize will exponentially increase as we target offenders who we know are driving without insurance.